Alright, making a video. Oh, I guess. Yep. Yeah, really hot today. And it's going to get cold again, so it's going to be bad. Ugh. Neuralgia in my jaw. Bad, bad, bad. <laughs> yeah. Ow. Uh, my teeth feel like they have skin. Anyway, my problem. Um, oh. 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 Oh would be good. <laughs> oh. Um, oh my god, no. Uh, Opus, no. Uh, all right. <sighs> Opposite, yeah. Some solid darker. See, that's how the brain works. That was some contrast there, you see? Dark and light. And my brain, uh, you know, brain, did that thing where it just said, um, contrast. And then it started doing synonyms, and it started doing things related, blah, blah, blah. And, yeah, opposite was in there somewhere. Um, so, anyway, it's a good word, opposite. It's almost like the negative word. <laughs> yeah, uh, but it's kind of funny. It just takes a little bit of a difference in philosophical foundational belief system, and you end up with these opposite values. Like completely upside down <laughs> you know it's like uh, I'm trying to kill Frankenstein and all these crazy town people are buying him lunch you know like what the fuck are you thinking assholes <laughs> it's fucking Frankenstein he's making monsters you dumbass and uh, they just keep like oh he doesn't mean to that's not what he's trying to do oh uh, you know he's trying to make the world a better place and give us you know, better cheese sandwiches, double cheese sandwiches. It's going to make double cheese sandwiches. And you're like, oh, come on, people. It's not double cheese sandwiches. Even if you had double cheese sandwiches, you'd want triple cheese sandwiches. Don't you get it? And this whole monster thing is just no good. You know. Ow. Oh, man, that one hurt. Ooh, that's a deep one. Got me real good. Yeah, that's a big, nasty hole. Um, yeah, gotta fix this. All right, I gotta do that, definitely. Definitely gotta get done now. Can't afford all these, all this damage I'm taking. Um, so anyway. Ow. <laughs> anyway, probably get some sort of microorganism infection and die now. But, you know, that would make some people happy and other people sad and it'd be opposite. It's kind of interesting. Anyway, um, yeah, so this is just so stupid. And but what is the the little the little change in perspective? I mean, people say like, oh, I know what suffering is. Well, well, if you know what it is, why the hell are you imposing it? What the fuck sense does that make? Um, come on, you know it's easy to stop. You just stop making this slop. And he talks about, he concedes that life is just kind of boulder pushing. And you're like, what the hell? So you're going to risk uh, the horror for, for this silly boulder pushing? I mean, until you come up with some um, better accomplishment than boulder pushing, uh, you really can't do any justifying. It's just such bullshit. So anyway, this video has gone on way too long for an alphabet video. But who cares? It doesn't matter. Yes, I'm going to basically say the same thing for every letter. Yeah, life is stupid. People are stupid. What the hell are we going to do with these assholes? we got all this brain, and we're not applying it to the real problem. Yeah, just symptoms. All you people are good for is you're not even good at it. That's the disgusting part. You're not even good at sopping up the blood. You're not even good maids. Uh, you know... And you won't take on the responsibility of being a fully competent and authorized janitor. So you're, you're just uh, you're just borgish little maids, you know, saying you're going to clean it up, and then doing it like, well, I'll do it tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll clean it up tomorrow. I'll fix it tomorrow. I mean, it's just so fucking lame. <sighs> anyway, so until the next letter. Which will probably be soon, because <laughs> I don't feel like talking about anything else. Uh, yeah.
So, till next time. Alright, P word. Nice stream. Yeah, it's really great when it gets hot like this <laughs> because all the people go away. So that'd be the word P. People. Nah, P. People sucks. So that's a good P words. Uh, so anyway, yeah, principles. That's a better one. Principles. What else could be better than principles? First principle, second principle, third principle. That's how our logic should be working. I mean, the first principle would be something like the do no harm. You know, in net effect, make sure, you know, or do your best to uh, have a net profit in your life experience. Leave the place better than when you got it. Kind of like the uh, timeshare at the condo. You know, don't degrade the place, make the place a little bit better, and that way you all win. Because you all have a more valuable property, and you have a nicer place to live. But humans don't do that. Fuck the first principle. <laughs> yeah, it's all about them, them, them. I want. I take. Me, me, me. So I will imprison six billion creatures every year and slaughter them. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Fucking assholes. Um, yeah, so you just go down this list, but... <laughs> You know, with this whole harm word, the whole idea of understanding that there is this thing that can be done that's a negative thing. And so there's been all this talk about consciousness. I don't know when this video will end up getting posted. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, everybody's talking about consciousness. But, uh, but, uh, um, um, that's no better. Better with but, uh. <clears throat> Yeah, so anyway, there's all this talk about consciousness, but very little conversation about the implications of it. What does it actually produce as a phenomenon? Obviously, it orders our behavior, but we are, as sentient beings, capable of being harmed. We can feel bad, bad. And for me, I have to explain that to people, that that means something. You know, even if it's all an illusion, which I believe it is, it's just something created in our brain. It's a, it's a projection our brain creates in a little internal movie theater. Uh, but it's still, th it's still theater. It's still there. It's happening. Uh, and uh, it's just insane, I think, uh, to deny that it has meaning, significance, and value. Uh, but there's a ton of people who are willing to do that. You know, last night I was in pretty good pain because I had this stupid neuralgia thing and the whole side of my face was all fucked up. And, uh, yeah, it hurt like hell. <laughs> you know, it was quite miserable. And it's like, there's nothing, you, you can't un, you can, you, there's just no way to just rationalize that away and say, oh, it didn't, it did just an illusion. <laughs> no, it hurt like hell. Um, you know, you're not telling me. It's just an illusion. It's one hell of a fucking illusion. Uh, so fuck this crap. But yeah, how can you have conversation with people that can't get the first thing right? They can't get the idea that there's a negative here. A big fat lady negative. A big fat lady elephant negative. A big fat blue well lady elephant. Well, blue well elephant wouldn't work, but it's a blue whale of a fucking goddamn uh, in the room. <laughs> yeah. It's hot. Uh, anyway. Um, so yeah, don't tell me it ain't real. Uh, and like I said, if we look at our little satisfied horninesses and hungers, oh boy. Pretty trivial. Uh, yep. And incredibly sillyly redundant. You can just see yourself just, you know, up, down, up, down, up, down. I mean, just, we just, it's just to keep doing the same shit over and over and over. I mean, when does the little pogo stick, uh, you know, get boring? How many times do you have to pogo before you say, fuck this stick? Um, yeah, so anyway, it, uh, 
what was, what, was on P, yeah, P, what was it again? Principle, yeah. Yeah, people have no principles. Sad. Not people. Certain particular people. Particular is another good P word. All right, well, anyway, this is way too long, too. Oh, fuck it. Ugh, till the later. Very nice, though. No people. No people. The world is all mine. This is too hot for the people. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Yay. I win. Till next time. All right, Q. Yeah. Um, anyway, nice day. Quality day. Quality. Uh, anyway, more nice scenics. Oh, people, crap. Anyway, yeah, I'm always going to end up walking faster than them. So this will be a problem. So I guess we will not bother with this video. Yeah, Q. No, I walk slower. All right, quality versus quantity. Yes, quality of steps versus the quantity of steps I'm taking. Yes, see, there's a quality step. Quality. It's there, and I can appreciate stuff because I'm taking quality steps. Um, which sort of reminds me of the meme thing. Because, you know, if you slow down and see things you'll see the world differently than when you're walking fast and uh, so that's how I do with the whole determinism thing and brain and all that and yes it's completely determined that I would slow down at this point and do this little thing in this monologue and blah 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 but the point is is there that little bit of variety is all it takes to create a completely different, well, not completely different. I don't believe DNA is God, so I'm not completely different. Um, mindset and appreciation. So if you take a quality, high resolution, look at nature and the dynamic of our life, you will realize that, uh, yeah, it's made out of shit. Yeah, I was just looking at the um, little little thing on top of that house. Probably can't see it, but there's this little thing on top of it. You know, a little fence on top of their house. Some little walkway up there, whatever it is. Little, I'm preposterously wealthy tower on top of their house. Um, anyway, <laughs> yeah, it's just the world is too sick and disgusting. Um, but anyway. Um, yeah, so I mean, is this, this this quality quantity? These are big, important words. We got to do quality thinking. Uh, quantity. There isn't that many uh, significant truths. You really don't have to get that many things right. You just have to know that this is chemistry and biology. That it exists because it's organized through a. a a reproducing chemical and a process of selection, natural selection, which basically means shit selection, uh, might makes right, blah blah blah, all those negative things. Um, yeah, and, and that's that uh, four billion years of that. Sentience is just uh, unfortunately, um, <laughs> you know, just happened to be the mechanism through which it started doing some of this behavior thing by creating this ouch mechanism to motivate beasties like ourselves and uh, to, to allow their, the creation, as far as we know, allowed the creation of uh, this intelligent organ that would somehow figure out how to deal with that ouch mechanism and uh, that would be a, a mechanism conducive to survival and obviously it's worked. There's lots of, lots of mammals roaming about doing the feeling intelligent thing. Yeah, okay, they don't know Einstein's theory, but, you know, they do know how to eke out a living in this rather crude world here. So obviously their brain is working pretty good, uh, doing some pretty interesting things. So anyway, uh, that reminds me of a conference board. I saw a video of his this, this morning, and 
he's just off his mark. I don't know what the hell's going on. I mean, you know, he, he makes, you know, 10 videos every two days uh, forever. And now he's making, you know, two videos every 10 days. And he uh, should at least say what the hell's going on. Let us in on the secret. Um, anyway, yeah, this walking slower thing is kind of fun. But <laughs> it's a terrible waste of time. Um, it's a nice little spot here. It's all kind of babbling. You can actually hear the brook babble. Hear it? It's babbling. Yeah. Um, anyway, uh, what was that? Quantity. Yeah, it's quality. Uh, yeah, so there's very few, very few of these big facts. Uh, all you, know, you gotta know is that suffering matters, that we're just desire machines. Gee, that's like the two, that's it. That it really isn't going anywhere because it's a mechanical universe, doesn't really give a shit. This is just one of the possible ways that it decomposes or composes itself. Um, and this is what matter can do under the circumstances, if they're provided. Uh, at least it happened once, and that's all we know of, though. It doesn't happen often. An unusual process. It's an unusual process. But spooky stuff. It is Frankensteinish. No doubt about it. Um, you know, I mean, just there's, you know, corpses everywhere. <laughs> Animated ones, even. So, anyway, this pond is just covered in duckweed. You probably see that you're taller than me. Anyway, um, yeah, this video is way too long. But I felt like talking, so I did. Ooh, what the hell is that? It looks like a horseshoe. Ah, it's a big fucking horse, though. Ah, probably a horse poo. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Weird, but I ain't reaching in there to get it. Forget it. No frogs there. Weird. Anyway. So. Um... Yeah, I'll catch up with you later, and such, and so forth, and whatnot. Ooh, nice shade. <gasps> oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Little rusty pegs glowing in the sunlight. I really do love the light on the trees. I do, I do. Okay, anyway, until next time. Oh, it certainly isn't worth all the shit going on. No, sir. Little glowy moments just aren't worth the price paid. Now, that's another video. So, till then, just 10 minutes from now, maybe. All right, little roar. Yep. <laughs> uh, rights. Yeah. Sorry. This falls right into place. Um, you know, that they're basically, you know, made out of wrongs. So if you can prevent doing wrongs, then it's a right. If it's not a wrong, it's a right. Basically, it's that whole freedom word. Uh, it's really not that hard. I mean, responsibility is probably a good word for our word. Rights, responsibilities, the two things go together. So I've basically said if you fulfill your responsibilities, then everything else is basically your right. Uh, if you don't have a... A responsibility then you're you know it's a right should be a right um, and uh, yeah really it's not that complicated so it relates to like your behavior do you have the right to impose um, is it a responsible thing to do to impose on something and uh, the simple answer is no impositions always suck if so you want to avoid them if possible what the hell is that? Oh, it's a leaf. Yeah, it's really cool. Um, so anyway. Yeah, it seems like there should be more to say on that subject, but it really is that simple. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so a really short video. Yay! A really short one for a change. Uh, I mean, my brain's just a little tired. Yeah, that's probably it. Um just ramble it's another R word ramble uh, Rediger yeah so it's South Park yeah I think so anyway um, 
Uh, it's really, there's nothing else. So we'll surrender, give up. Uh, uh, yeah, till next time. And such.